I've taken one question from the chapter integration, and this is question number 23 from miscellaneous exercise. Now, to in order to simplify this question, what I'm going to use is to apply the property of log and the two properties I'll be applying. The first one is like n log x is what? n log x is same as log x raised to the power n. That means I can write 2 log x as log x raised to the power 2. That is for this part, right? And what is log a? Log a plus log b is log a into, sorry, log a minus log b. I'll show you once again. This is log a minus log b, right? So log a minus log b is what? Log a over b, right? So it's a over b. And what is a for us? A is, as you can see in the question, it is x squared plus 1. And what is b? B we have obtained this, which is this, right? So that means I can uh, directly write this. I can write this directly as log this, right? After applying. So this is what I'll do. So in the first part, I'll write this as uh, x square over 1 that divided by x power 4. And this, as I said, I simplified the other part. That is, this is log x square plus 1 over x square. So this is integration dx and i is this only, i is equal to. Now one more part of simplification, what I'll do here, this is i is equal to. Let's say if I write this as x square plus 1 only, this is x square plus 1, I can write x raised to the power 4 as x into x cube. Now, you'll soon understand why I'm doing so in the very next step. And this is, say, I write this as it is raised, dx. Now, check here. Can I write this x square? Can I write this x as x is same as under root x square? That's what we will do. So, in the next step, I'm replacing this x right with under root x square so what we get there for so this is uh, i is equal to integration and this is 1 over x cube this is under root x square plus 1 and this is what as i said i'm going to replace this x with what under root x square right this is under root x square the reason is explained over here. And let's say continue with this. This is log, it should be mod, x square plus 1 over x square, whole integration dx. In the next part, what you can observe here that, let me raise these things. This is 1 over integration. 1 over x cube. This I can write as what? Whole integration. We can write in a, so not integration, whole under root, this. That is log mod. This is x square plus 1 over x square dx. Now this I did so, so as to frame the same expression inside the root and inside that log modulus. Let's continue with the next step. So i comes out to be what? Integration 1 over x cube. I can write this. This I can replace as what? You can see that if I split this, x square over x square is 1 and 1 over x square. And then we have log. This is log mod same way here too i can write this as x square by x square that is splitting over one by x square this is uh, dx would end with now what in case if i take this as t right so if i take if i take you have to write somewhere in the exam i'm writing 
here in rough. If I take this as T, you know, then its differentiation is what? The differentiation of one is zero, and this is actually x raised to the power minus two, right? So x raised to the power minus two differentiation is minus two x raised to the power minus three, which is minus two over x raised to the power minus three. That's what I needed this. So we once again explaining you this, I'm going to replace with dt, including minus two, right? So I just remove this one here. The number one is minus two into one is minus two only. This and dx will replace with dt. So as I as you can see, or if I need to write once again, I'll write it over here properly. That means I have taken, I have taken one plus one over x square as t and its integration I have shown with working that it is minus two x raised to the power three dx is equal to dt. Now come back to the main working part of the question. This is minus one over two integration. This is going to be replaced with this and this is going to be replaced with dt. So we are left with this, which is under root t. This is under root t, right? And plus log mod, this is log mod t, right? So we got this and uh, this is under root t is same as t raised to the power half. This is t raised to the power half here. Now you can see that here will be applying by parts here, right? Integration by parts. So therefore I need space and I'll be raising this left hand side portion. For this working, so I'll write it over here. This is I is equal to minus half and I'm applying by parts. As you can see that uh, this is going to be the first term. So this is log T, right? And then into integration of the second term that is t raised to the power half dt minus whole integration d by dx d by dx of the first and first is what log t minus minus integration of the second that is t raised to the power half dx and then we have whole dx so now, now let's continue with the same thing. That is uh, minus half. This is log t. Now, first I'll get the integration of this. This is what the integration of this is what t raised to the power half is t raised to the power 3 by 2 multiplied by 2 by 3. And then this is log t here for this minus whole integration d by dx of log t is what? 1 by t. This is multiply. This is log t uh, differentiation, right? d by dx of log t is 1 by t. That multiplied by same way is going to be integration of this, which is t raised to the power 3 by 2. That multiplied by 2 by 3. So I can write 2 by 3 here. This is dt. So i comes out to be minus half outside this is 2 over 3 t raised to the power 3 by 2 log t minus 2 over 3 non simplifying this is what i'll get as this is 3 by 2 1.5 and 1 so by laws of exponent you'll get t raised to the power half dt now it seems we are on the last part so i is equal to minus 1 by 2 this is 2 over 3 t raised to the power 3 by 2 log t minus 2 by 3. And what's the integration of t raised to the power half? It is t raised to the power 3 by 2. That is 1 plus 2, 3 by 2 into 2 by 3. Bracket closed. Now, now from here, what you can see that uh, we can take out. This is 2 by 3 t raised to the power 3 by 2 as common, right? Outside, we can take out this. This is to simplify it further. This I'm taking out. So we have minus 1 by 2, that multiplied by 2 by 3. And this is t raised to the power 3 over 2.
So what will be left inside the bracket will be log mod t and minus 2 over 3. Should be minus 2 over 3 plus c. I left plus c. You should put in plus c the moment the integration ends. So this get cancelled here. So this is minus 1 by 3. And what is t here? t is this. So I'm replacing t. I can write this t is same as or let's say 1 over 1 plus x square and this is log mod t replacing once again t with 1 plus 1 over x square minus and this minus 2 by 3. This is uh, not inside let's say don't get confused this should be enclosed in a bracket minus 2 by 3 plus c and better if you put a modulus sign over here. So this should be the final answer for this question.